we was. My rocket jet going full blast. McQueen hanging on for dear life when suddenly them two nasty lemons come out of nowhere with guns drawn. We was goners. But then, out of nowhere, this beautiful spy car swoops in from the sky to save us. That's a very entertaining story, young man. Oh, Minnie, please, come on. None of this happened. Rocket jets, flying spy cars. No, you're quite right. It does sound a bit far-fetched. Holly, what are you doing here? Hello, Mater. It's so good to see you again. Finn! Our satellites picked up an urgent communique. Oh, so you got to my email. Oh, man. Y'all is going to have a great time. Everybody, this here is Finn McMessel. He's a secret agent. Don't tell nobody. This is Holly Shiftwell. She... I'm Mater's girlfriend. It's so nice to meet you all. Guido believe you now. Whoa, honey, you got a nasty dent there. Yeah. Was that from when you swooped in and you saved them in London? Van! What? I'm just asking! Ah, oh, don't you worry, sweet pea. My baby Ramon can get that fixed up for you in no time. Yeah, sure thing, man. No problemo. Just let me go get my tools. Oh, no, no, no. I- I'm keeping that dent. It's way too valuable. A valuable dent? Oh, she's as crazy as Mater. Ah, uh, those two are perfect for each other. Now, there's one thing I still don't get. The bad guys hit me with the beam from the camera, right? So, why didn't I, you know... Explode in a fiery inferno? Yeah. We couldn't figure that one out either. Our investigation proved that all in all was actually gasoline. And Axelrod engineered it so that when it got hit by the beam, it would explode. Wait a second, Fillmore. You said my fuel was safe. If you're implying that I switched out that rot good excuse for alternative fuel with my all-natural sustainable organic biofuel just because I never trusted Axelrod, you're dead wrong, man. It was him. Once big oil, always big oil. Man. Tree hugger. The Radiator Springs Grand Prix is about to begin. All spectators, clear the starting line. Man, I can't wait to get rocking. This is gonna be wicked. Yeah, we should do this every year. Yeah, I just figured we never found out who the world's fastest car is. Plus, no press, no trophy. Just racing, the way I like it. Francesco likes it like this too. Francesco, I'd like you to meet... Signorina Salvi. It is official. Lightning McQueen is the luckiest car in the world. Oh, why, thank you. <laughs> Which he will have to be to have a chance against Francesco today. See you at the finish line, Mc... What is that? Ah, just something I had made up for the occasion. It's a good McQueen, very funny. It was a funny when I did it, but it's a very funny. What are you going to do next? Are you going to take off your fenders? Try it. You'll like it. So he's not so good looking. Yeah, nice try. I'm serious. <laughs> That's why I love you, Sally. Wish me luck. You don't need it. Mm-hmm. That Francesco is fine looking. And those open wheels. Ooh. I'm gonna have to go get myself some coolant.